what is going on everybody out on the bike again we got to head to the store i didn't think i was gonna ride get to ride today oh uh, i had i charged my bike up this morning and i was fixing to leave and go get it get on it to go to the store and it started thundering so I looked on the weather app and it said it's supposed to stop stop around three, but it never rained. Now let's see, today is June the 7th. It's 3.43 p.m. It's 88 degrees and partly cloudy. And I tell you, it feels good out here. That breeze feels good. Couldn't ask for a better day to ride. Now, just hope it doesn't rain. I looked at the radar, it didn't look like any rain was coming. So, I think we'll be good. Uh, I looked online, I think I found me a milk crate to go on the back of my bike to hook to my rack back there. Found one at Walmart, it's a collapsible one. Says, it says it can hold up to 50 pounds but that i think that's all i can i think that's all i can put on the back of my bike anyway is 50 pounds it's like 12 bucks it's uh 13 by 13 is the dimensions of it and i can't remember how tall it is i want to say like nine inches tall something like that but you know I think, I think I can fit quite a few things in it. So I may ride up to Walmart and look at it. But today we gotta get, gotta get a loaf of bread and I'm gonna pick up a salad. I was gonna, I was gonna just go get the bread, but we're having red beans and rice tonight. That's some good stuff there. The only bad thing with the red beans and rice is you know I can't have a lot of carbs for my meals, so rice is high in carbs. Beans have a lot of carbs in it too, but it also has fiber, a lot of fiber in them. So when I'm counting my carbs, I can subtract the fi whatever fiber is in there. I can subtract that off the carbs. So won't be able to put a lot of rice in there. So I think I'm gonna get me a salad. I'm gonna have me a big old salad uh, with it. And I know the I know the salad dressing has carbs in it. I think the salad has a few carbs in it, but that's fine. It won't be that, it won't be that many carbs. Well, I'm pretty pumped up about dirt. Oh, you almost ran into me. You need to watch where you're going. had my first accident there I'm glad she saw me because I sure didn't see her coming glad I stopped there because he was looking the other way he wasn't he didn't even look this way <laughs> Yeah, I'm uh, pretty pumped up about Thursday. That's tomorrow. I'm recording this on a Wednesday. The video, this, and the video, I'm posting it on tomorrow too, Thursday. So I'm pretty pumped up about Thursday. Got a new course coming out on Walkabout Putt Putt, Journey to the Center of the Earth. So I'm, I'm kind of anxious about that one. They've been advertising that one for so long. I think, 
I think they I think they started advertising Journey to the Center, the center of the earth. And then three more courses came out, I believe. I think it was I want to say 20,000 leagues under the sea, mist, and uh Temple at Zazura came out. And Journey to the Center of the Earth was uh announced before that actually i think it was announced with when labyrinth came out and labyrinth came out right before twenty thousand leagues under the sea so i'm expecting that course to be pretty good i think they've probably been working on that one for a while Oh, and Upside Town has come out too. The one where you're, you can put on the walls and the ceiling and all that. It's a fun course. Actually, that course, we played that the other night and I broke my record, shot 23 under on it. <clears throat> and I messed up on two holes that I normally don't mess up on. And I got an extra stroke. I parred them instead of birdied them. I could have had 25 under. And 25 is the top score on the leaderboard right now. So that was kind of, I mean, I'm glad I beat my record, but it was still a little disappointing. Actually, I've been getting my cokes, my cokes at this store uh, the last two times because they've had them on sale. They've been cheaper than Walmart, and that's unusual. Normally, they're more expensive than Walmart on everything. Didn't even see me drive by him. Head in the phone. They moved their bench from from in the front where I usually lock my bike up. So I just gotta leave it out. I don't think anybody will take it. <clears throat> so they used to have a bench right there. You can see it in the other videos. All right. How many miles is it? 3.2 miles. Right. So we're going to take the key out. salad kits with everything in it. Mm. Oh, excuse me. I'm sorry. So that's going to be the salad tonight. Now, let's go get the bread. And 
and this is the best bread right here, this butter bread. It's the 15th. There's an 18th. It's nature's own butter bread. That's the best you can get. Uh, I don't think we're going to get any desserts. I tell you, their banana pudding's good. Lemon ice box pie, chocolate cream pie. Look at that, Boston cream cheese, Boston dream cake. Well, that looks good. All right, so that'll be all. All right, I'm gonna stop the recording one while I get in line. All right. Oh, sitting there trying to mash the button to turn it on, and I. I didn't put the key in the bottom. I hardly ever take the key out. There we go. Okay, I was talking, I was checking out in the cashier. Oh. Uh, was sitting there asking me well I know you got that thing strapped to you <clears throat> I know it's a camera what's it for I said I said to record well I know and she said well I know that she said well I mean what, what what's it what, what why do you record I said well I'm riding my bike she said I figured that you got your helmet on I said well I said I record all my rides and she said, well, why do you do that? I said, well, I said, you know, of course for YouTube, but, and then I, I told her, you know, it's good to record your rides in case something happens. You got it on video. You know, when, when something happens, there's their side of the story, your side of the story, and then there's the truth, the camera. The camera don't lie. told her what kind of bike I had she said she saw ads on Facebook where these electric bikes were uh, like 300 and something dollars I said well I said I know this one cost about a thousand the one I have so I said you know if you if, you, if you're gonna order the brand I have, I just just order it from the company. I don't think you can buy it from anybody else. I think I think they're the only ones that sell it. I said you set you you go online, you order it, free shipping, comes in the box and it's already put together. All you got all you do is take it out of the box and unfold it. It's ready to go. And when I told her I had an e-bike, she said, "Oh, so you don't." pedal you don't get any exercise I said well I can do either one I can pedal or throttle oh she said oh you get to choose I said yeah I guess I guess she was asking asking because she said she rides her bike to work she said she has a Schwinn it's not an electric bike though I don't know if we're going to get any rain today it's looking a little bit cloudy in front of us be nice to get some rain cool it off a little bit I know the weather last night said it's, it's supposed to be six degrees warmer today than it was yesterday but I'm not so sure it feels that much warmer well probably because it's cloudy I know yesterday it was up in the up in the 90s. Well, we're giving giving my first test next week. Monday and Tuesday is my first test. My cal my calculus one class is taking their test Monday, and my calculus three class is taking their test uh, Wednesday. 
going to see how that's going to go. They still don't have the proctors. I, I told them, I said, you got to have the proctors done by today. And today's Wednesday the 7th. And they don't, and they don't have it done. So I told them they better have it done today or they can get a zero on the test. Because i got to call these proctors tomorrow and verify them. Yes, believe it or not, they'll give you false information. They'll try to, they'll try to get a friend to proctor the test for them. I know that sounds hard to believe, but they'll do it. Not all of them, but some of them will try it. So, we are almost home. I think I'm gonna call it a video. As usual, I will leave the camera running in case something exciting happens. I hope you enjoyed this one. Check out my other videos. Give me a like, share, subscribe, comment. Thanks for watching, and I will see y'all in the next one. Later.